Corvo, if only there was someone else I trusted to send, so that you could remain near. But there is no one else, and the Spymaster was right to insist that I send you. The plague has taken so many, and we must find a cure. When you are near, my heart is at peace. Emily and I will count the days until you return. Hurry home, and bring good news. Steady hand. That's it. Watch it. Cast off line. Casting off. We're away. Take us straight to Dunwall Tower. Lord Corvo has news for the Empress, and we've come a long way. A long way to bring bad news. We know there's a cure for the plague by now. Maybe. We live in strange times. Sending the Empress's bodyguard away for a couple of months. That's unusual. Well, this was important. We need help with the rat boy. Good traveling with you, Corvo. You know what to do next time? Yes, yes. The pressure was too low. All these new machines are touchy. Just don't do anything crazy. Sokolov's changed everything. We don't know what the hydraulics do. Fewer ships moving along the river now. With the plague and all. Welcome back, Lord Protector. It's an honor to see you. There he is. Good boy, sir. Hello, sir. Corvo, you're back! Will you tell me about your trip, please? Were there any whales? Wait! Let's play hide-and-seek first. I'll cover my eyes and you hide. You have time? Mother's busy talking to that nasty old spy master. Okay, here we go. Did you see any monsters while traveling? Welcome home, Lord Protector. Stop moving, Campbell. And you, Corvo, welcome back. From wherever you've been. They sent him.
Let's see if you're still good at this. I'll hide my eyes and count, and at the end of the countdown, I'll try and find you. Okay, I'm going to count to ten. Find a place to hide. Somewhere else then. Okay, you win. We should go now, so Mother can see you too. Uh. Saw my improvements to the water lock. I'm not so sure that painting looks like Campbell. Later, will you show me that TV and chokehold like you promised? I won't tell mother. What are you doing? I need the bottle. It was a fool's errand away from Campbell. The plague comes from inside. I suppose us. I can paint him without sight. Huh? Though in truth, he is always close to the stuff. She'll see you at once. Have you ever met my niece Callista? She's getting more beautiful every year. Hello, my lord. They're sick people, not criminals. We've gone beyond that question, your majesty. They're... They're my citizens, and we will save them from the plague if we can. All of them. Very well. We will not speak of this again. Mother, Corvo is back. Thank you, Emily. Leave us, please. As you wish, Your Majesty. Corvo. Two days early. Full of surprises, as usual. It's a fair wind that brings you home to me. What news have Follow you brought? Follow me, Captain. We should leave. I hope that one of the other cities had dealt with this before, knew of some cure. This news is very bad. We're at the breaking point. Cowards. They're going to blockade us. They'll wait to see if the plague turns the city into a graveyard. Are you okay, Mother? You seem sad. Yes, don't worry, darling. Mother is fine. Wait, where are the guards? Who sent them away? Mother, look! What are they doing on the rooftop? What? Emily, come here! Thank you. 
If you hadn't been here... No more! Not again! Mommy! No! Get away from her! Corvo! Corvo, it's all coming apart. Find, find Emily. Protect her. You're the only one who'll know what to do. Won't you? Corvo. Ward us all. Look at what he's done. Yes, he's killed the Empress. What did you do with young Lady Emily, traitor? Her own bodyguard. Ironic. I'll see you beheaded for this, Corvo. Take him. Chance, Corvo. Sign the confession and let me give you the rights to put your spirit at ease. That's enough for now. Get out. Let's give the man some time to think. Corvo, the Empress is dead. Her daughter Emily is hidden away, and no one will ever know the truth. Yes, unlucky you. Tomorrow you'll be executed, but it's for a good cause. This country needs strong leadership now, someone to guide the weak. And that's where we come in. There was nothing personal in this, even though you almost sank our plans. But it turned out well. You were in the wrong place at the right time, and someone has to take the fall. Goodbye, Corvo. Guards! Take him back to his cell. You should eat, Corvo. This meal comes from a friend.
So many people are coming to the execution tomorrow. It's on account of Corvo, the one who killed the Empress and abducted her daughter, Emily. So it's an occasion. Right. A social event for the High and Mighty. Come see the noble Lord Protector get his head chopped off. You're as bad as us betting on the dogfights. Attention. The solitary wing is off limits to maintenance crews, unless accompanied by an officer of the watch. Escort through the... must be scheduled in advance, with one week's notice. Maybe wind or something. Hey, don't you owe me a drink? Blow off. Dignitaries only.
military wing. Unless accompanied by an officer of the watch, escort through the solitary wing must be scheduled in advance with one week's notice. Dignitaries only.
Sorry. Not yet. I was gonna report that boiler leak from yesterday. Forget it. Just do your right. Attention. Tomorrow's execution will be restricted to the personnel assigned to the event and approved dignitaries only. of elixir from today? Shut up. Attention. Tomorrow's execution will be restricted to the personnel assigned to the event and approved dignitaries only.
restricted to the personnel assigned to the event and approved dignitaries only. I guess if you'll kill the Empress, you don't care about a few guards. Shut up! Look at this stuff. Trash. Could be some down here by the look of it. Good. If we're lucky, one of them will get Corvo. You're afraid of him? He's Sir Conan. It's all merchants and whores down there. Kids like you, he never saw what he was like. I saw him fight three to one in the practice yard. In a whirlwind. I hope it's me that finds him. I hope it is too.
load of bodies in the carts headed to the flooded district? Yeah. But screw that. That's too far. I don't want to catch the plague, do you? No. Doesn't the elixir prevent it? Maybe. Either way, let's just dump them down there. That's a rat's head.
He won't get past me, sir. Do you know who we're hunting here? Don't try to take him out alone. And what if no one from the squad is around? Don't try to make a lot of noise when you die. Knock something over if you can. Bastard. Smells like a dead weeper in here. Come here to die sometimes in the dark. Just slip into the water. Don't come out. What in the void was that? Dunwall citizens, the assassin Corvo, responsible for the murder of our fair empress and the disappearance of Lady Emily, heir to the throne, has temporarily escaped state custody. Several brave Corvo, officers over here, quickly. I'm a, I'm Samuel, and I work for some good people who want very much to meet you. Well, they said you'd come out here. I could still hardly believe it. I'll take you to meet them, just down the river from here. Pub. 
closed for business, half the district marked off as dead from the plague. We're right under the Lord Regent's nose, and he don't know a thing. Of course, if anyone finds out what we're up to, the watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. Take you up to meet Admiral Havelock and the rest of the Royalists. The Admiral's a man to be reckoned with. If anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, and clear your name, he can. I expect they're hard at work in there. Best join them. They'll help you get whoever really killed the Empress. Even after six months in Cold Ridge Prison East. We can continue this later, Lord Pendleton. The man of the hour is here. Corvo, I'm Admiral Havelock. A true servant of the Empire, like you. Until the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility in our little group. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. This is a momentous occasion, Corvo. I'm going to come out with it. We've been building a coalition of loyalists, aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. We've got big plans, but we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight, and in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. Sorry, you must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you've recovered. But before you retire, you should introduce yourself to Piero. He's challenging at times, but his industrious mind buys him that right. Yes, Piero's as much an artist as a technician. He's going to be crafting the gear you'll need. Go talk to him, and then get some sleep. We can talk more when you've rested. small amount of complaining by that antiquated boatman. The others have no idea what it's like to suffer as I have. Speaking of which... Wallace! Please breathe two bottles of Dunwall Red, never mind which, and fetch a clean glass. Ah, <sighs> well... I'll begin again tomorrow.
Pendleton's voting block. Military connections. All we've lacked is the ability to reject lethal force in a controlled manner against a previously inaccessible... Ah, to the point. We need a man who can kill the bastards for us. Corvo is more than capable of that, I have no doubt. End ball. This is awful. Switch. My, you must be court. I am Lydia, at your service. Your room is upstairs and ready. When they told me who it was, well, I thought you'd be older, like the Admiral. Do not attempt to have your for a friend or family member who shows signs of blood on their face and chest area. The only way to help them is to bring them to the City Watch. They will be taken to the Flooded District for treatment. Attention Dunwall citizens, be advised the river crust infestation has spread downriver as far as the river mouth and flooded district. Do not attempt to approach or destroy a river crust. Any items recovered from doing so are considered state property. The Admiral served in the Navy under the Empress, but something happened with the Lord Regent Attention that drove the Admiral out, Lady Emily if I understand it right. Six months ago during her mother's terrible murder. Anyone with information leading to the location or return of the daughter of our beloved late Empress is required to speak to the City Watch at once.
I once served under Admiral Havelock. Captain Havelock then. I don't know if he remembers me, but I fear it's rude to ask. I don't want to embarrass him. Attention all citizens, curfew extends from sundown to sunrise unless you are otherwise authorized. Violators will be subject to interrogation. I'll be crafting your weapons and gear. All custom work. For you, I will create the tools of a master assassin. No! This cannot happen now, the tank of whale oil. Will you get a new tank from upstairs, please, while I hold this in place? Be careful. The oil's unstable. When it explodes, there is a terrible mess. Perfect. Now plug it in. Perfect. Thank you, Cole. Here, see? The assassin's mask. 
You're a wanted man, so everyone in the city knows your face. But this mask will be terror to them. If you just hold still, fit must be precise. There. Can you see normally? Send the lens out of alignment. There. Better now? I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. Scavenge the city for valuables, and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. Tell me what I can make. Life will get even more difficult soon. You should rest while you can. Sleep well. Your life has taken a turn, has it not? The Empress is dead. Her precious daughter Emily is lost somewhere in the city, and you will play a pivotal role in the days to come. For this, I have chosen you and drawn you into the void. I am the Outsider, and this is my mark. There are forces in the world and beyond the world, great forces that many call magic, and now, these forces will serve your will. Use this newfound power, my gift to you. Come find me.
that follow, your trials will be great, Corvo. Seek the ancient runes bearing my mark in the lonely places of your world, and at shrines raised in my name. These runes will grant you powers beyond those of other men. To help you find these runes, I give you this, the heart of a living thing, molded by my hands. With this heart, you will hear many secrets, and it will guide you toward my runes, no matter how they may be hidden. Listen to the heart now, and find another room. what I have given you falls upon you, as it has to the others before you. And now I return you to your world, but know that I will be watching with great interest.
and can often be liberal consumption of Sokolov's elixir. Once bleeding from the eyes occurs, death is inevitable. Should I clear space for Samuel then? If you like, but he won't use it. Why? He can't sleep in regular beds anymore, or that's what he says. He says he was in the Navy too long. Can you believe it? Oh. That pile of wood out there? It's a hovel he built from an old rowboat. Where does Admiral Hadlock find these people, I wonder? Well, let's get down to it. First off, I know that assassination is dark business. But sometimes, good men have to do bad things to make the world right. Our purpose is clear. We want to restore Her Majesty's line by finding and putting Emily Caldwin on the throne. To those ends, we'll hide, act in shadow, take them apart, piece by piece. Tonight, High Overseer Campbell dies by your hand. It won't be easy. He's protected by his overseers, an army of religious zealots. But if anyone can do it, you can. Your exploits are legendary. Campbell carries a private journal. Once you've eliminated him, get the journal, because we think it contains Emily's location. Recovering her is obviously critical, assuming she's alive. That's the gist of it. Remember our cause and strike true. We're counting on you. Another thing. Campbell is holding a former overseer by the name of Martin. He's one of us, and if you manage to find him, give him whatever help you can. He's a master strategist, and he got caught working for our cause. It'd be good to have him back here at the Howl Pits. Oh, Corvo? If... Corvo. Hello. I'm Callista. I work here for Admiral Havelock. I'm sorry to intrude on your business, but this is important. I suspect you're going to kill the High Overseer. That wretched man. There's really no reason for you to listen to me. But my uncle, Jeff Kernow, still serves as captain in the City Watch. But he's a good man, and my only family. The chatter in servant circles is that Campbell just took delivery of an exotic poison. And I think I know why. My uncle's not corruptible like the rest of them. Campbell is going to poison my uncle. Do you think you could protect him? You used to do that, right? Before you had your current profession. Before you became an assassin. Just wanderings. Ready to go? Just give the signal. straight up Clavering Boulevard, but now it's not so easy. Half the city's dead of the plague. The other half's fighting over what's left. The City Watch still holds the bigger streets, and they've set up those wall of light checkpoints. A man walks through one of those, and he ends up burned to a crisp. Everything not controlled by the City Watch is gang territory. There are the real odd birds living on the fringes like that Granny Rags. They say she's nuts. Which is worse? Just take your pick.
easy, damn it. Keep them in the boat. The canal's got enough shit in it as it is. Mm, nasty furry filth. Hey! <laughs> what is it? I think that last one was moving. What? Yeah, the little one. Not possible. Pass I inspected them myself. Keep All working. The others. Down with the sickness. Well, he ain't moving no more. <laughs> Good. Keep them coming. One, two, three, heave! Following direct contact with an infected or weeping individual, you are required to remain in isolation for two continuous days. If signs of infection occur, report for transport to the flooded district. from the play. Better them than us. At least some of them have money. Good. Keep them coming. Two arms! Wash it. 